At the height of the COVID-19 pandemic lockdown in 2020, Santos Tus downloaded TikTok. Creating a profile, he selected education as one of his interests and quickly found an audience. People across his native Mexico and the wider world interested in learning his mother tongue. Mayan. The number of Mayan speakers is reducing every year, and that has a lot to do with discrimination. But with my videos, I wanted to show people that this language is something for us to feel proud of. Three years later, Santos has garnered an audience of more than 300,000, teaching an ancient language through the 21st century social media phenomenon. I have had messages from people all over the world, from Spain, the US, Canada, France. It's a good educational platform to share art, science, and in my case, language. It reaches all ages, from kids, teenagers, adults and older people. At 58, Ana Maria Kawic is perhaps not your typical TikTok user. Nevertheless, the platform has helped her fill a gap she feels in her cultural identity. My dad and my mom are Mayeros. They speak Maya. My parents spoke Mayan, but they never spoke to their children in that language. They spoke to us in Spanish. My desire is to learn to speak fluently, to be able to communicate with my own people. She follows Santos on TikTok and says his videos are helping her where her own family could not. TikTok is a great tool to practice speaking. It feels like the person is present, so it helps me. Learning Mayan through social media led Ana Maria to language classes at the Yucatan Mayan Cultural Institute, where director Eric Villanueva says the resurgence can bring enormous social benefits. Estamos como en una etapa de transición porque vamos saliendo. Not long ago, indigenous languages in Mexico were actively being eliminated. That a transition is happening towards their promotion and recognition. To teach Mayan is to teach people about their own indigenous culture, and we are seeing a rebirth of pride in their Mayan heritage among our young people. El orgullo, el orgullo Maya en, en, en los jóvenes. Chacal has. As social media does its part to keep indigenous language alive, the cultural identity it fosters may bring native communities closer together. Alastair Bavastok, CGTN, Yucatan, Mexico. Bueno, cuídate.